What's up, nerds? So they dropped this newest episode of Star Trek Strange New Worlds early. I'm not quite sure what's happening, but it's the big crossover event with Lower Decks, you know, that crappy cartoon. I bailed like right before it became that hentai, you know, episode. So I just wasn't interested in that show. It's not very good. It's bad. It's not funny. All that stuff. This episode, I have thoughts, which I'm going to share with you after the breakdown and during. So why don't we jump right into it and then we'll discuss it all at the end. All right, here we go. In the 24th century, Ensign Brad Boimler of the USS Cerritos is assigned to investigate an ancient portal which sends him back in time 120 years. Again, it's this cartoon world where they just go on and on how Boimler's this big loser and a big simp and everything, and Mariner, she's, you know, a big fuck up, but she, like, gets away with it every five seconds, so who cares, because, you know, powerful women. And then they also go into this thing about how, like, well, not all Orions were pirates, and that's racist. And you're like, oh, get the fuck out of here, She-Hulk. There he is taken aboard the Enterprise. Well, of course he is, you know, the Enterprise, it's part of the show. And they do the intro like they normally do, except for it's all cartoonized, which I mean was kind of cool, but at the same time, I'm just like, I don't care. Boimler struggles to contain his excitement at meeting his heroes and also to prevent polluting the timeline with his knowledge of the future. This again, like, I don't like the Boimler character, but I do love this Quaid kid. I think he's like a good actor. I love him on The Boys, but... This character sucks, so I just didn't like him in this episode. The portal is taken by an Orion spaceship, and Pike trades grain supplies to retrieve it. Yeah, this whole thing with the grain and the Orions, it was just, like, so, like, boring, and I just didn't care. However, when they attempt to return Boimler with the last remaining Heronium needed to achieve it, Beckett Mariner appears through the portal attempting to rescue Boimler. And of course, Mariner pops through that little portal and ruins everything. Cause like she always does in every single episode of that dumb cartoon. She ruins everything and there's no repercussions for it on terms of punishment on her part. And, you know, whatever. Spock and Boimler unsuccessfully try to synthesize Heronium to make another attempt at the time travel. Yeah, this part was so stupid because Boimler the whole time is like, oh, you smiled. Oh, no. And, and Spock's all like, you know, the characteristics of my future self and everything. And you're all like, oh, my God, this is so stupid. I hate this episode. While Mariner and Uhura work to translate the portal's engravings. And the whole time Mariner is trying to scissor Ahura, and I'm all like, this is not Ahura. I'm sorry. And the actress playing Ahura, I don't understand why they write this character. She's like, I don't know what to do. I need to go through all my calculations. I don't have time for fun. And she's like, oh, you need to relax, have some cocktails and everything. And I'm all like, this is so stupid and boring. I hate it. Boiler realizes Heronium from the hull of the NX-01 Enterprise was incorporated into the new ship. Because, of course, what they need is on the ship, you know? <laughs> so I love how all the women in this movie also, like, they're lifting up that big heavy panel because they're strong, powerful women. And the men just, like, look like idiots the whole time. It's so obnoxious and annoying. Allowing him and Mariner to return to their own time. Yeah, and so they travel back through the portal thing and they go back to their cartoon world, which I'm all like, great. So they can go from one shitty show back to their shitty show. And, and that's the end of the episode, you guys. This episode was not funny. Like they were trying to make jokes the whole time. Like when, when Spock smiled, they like zoomed in on his teeth and I'm all like, well, his teeth are a little fucked up. And this episode was, it wasn't funny. It wasn't clever. It wasn't witty. It wasn't engaging. I did not have a good time with this episode. I mean, they crossed over with another show, but at the same time, I'm all like, I don't care. I don't care at all. And, and of course, they used the two humans of the group. They couldn't have used the Orion character because that would cause them to, what, paint an actor green. Um, and they couldn't use the cyborg kid because that would cause for, what, practical effects on their face. And I'm all like, it's it's just so stupid, you know? I didn't, I just didn't like this episode. I don't like this show. I don't like both shows. Uh, so I guess, you know... I'm glad that I don't have to watch it Thursday, I guess, or review it Thursday. I'm getting ahead of it, you know, because I just, 
I don't know, man. This season sucks. I don't even know where this season is going. Where is this season going besides being bad? You know, it's going to hell in a handbasket. That's where it's going. I said this in my last review. It had I had a glimmer of hope that it would be good uh, because of season one. But season one, like I just thought was just OK. And this season just sucks bad it's so bad it sucks so ryan balls i just don't like it at all but you know maybe it's just me but i doubt it uh but if you like this you know good i'm i always say this i i, I you know i watch it because it's trek and i'm jealous of people that that watch this and they love it i'm jealous because i want to love it you know like i did picard season three i want to love it i want to go in every single episode and just being like yes 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 and this show is not doing it uh you know and lower decks is definitely not doing it that show sucks balls orion balls uh but yeah i'm i'm sorry i, I i'm not sorry i they 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 did bad on this episode i mean it was just it was just bad it's bad i hate those characters of boiler and mariner um the other they should have brought the other two characters because those other two characters I actually don't mind them that much but whatever it's fine and that's my breakdown and review of this episode I think we only uh, this I think this is only 13 episodes this season so we only have like what like four more thank god uh so I don't know oh no six more six more I don't know I'm not gonna the math isn't mathing in my head uh but anyways but tell me what you guys thought about this episode. Did you like it? Did you not like it? What was your favorite part? You know, do you like Lower Decks? What do you think about this season two of Strange New Worlds overall? Um, just tell me what you guys think. You can, uh, you know, if you like what I do here and you enjoy independent content here on YouTube, please consider subscribing to my channel. YouTube is always changing up their algorithm. And small channels like mine, we just keep getting shoved to the back of the line. So please ask that you like, share, and subscribe. And I thank you in advance. And as always, go ahead and leave all your comments in that section down below. If you like this video, go and hit that like button. You know, I won't mind. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys next week on my Star Trek Strange New Worlds Breakdown and Review. You guys have a good week. Live long and prosper. Bye.